World News Wednesday, World News Wednesday. Who's the diva of the club that's made for you and me? D-I-S-N-E-Y, D-I-V-E-A, Disney Diva. World News Wednesday, Disney Diva. World News Wednesday, forever let us hold us band. Hi, 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 hi. Come along and sing a song and join the jamboree. D-I-S-N-E-Y, D-I-V-E-A. World News Wednesday. So how y'all doing? How y'all doing? <laughs> oh, Lord. Welcome to World News Wednesday number 135. Take one. Oh, Lord, help me. They're, they're, yeah, woo, doggy. So it's, we got a storm coming named Fred. Yeah, it's going to hit this weekend. And I was hoping it'd be come over to the East Coast because the east side of the storm is always the worst. So we're going to get a lot of rain and some wind and some other stuff. Yeah, so here comes Fred. Look out. He's trolling behind Elsa. He's going to get him some. <laughs> so anyhow. <laughs> Lord. Let's, let's head over to Magic Kingdom, shall we? All right. Uh, the Jungle Cruise uh, got some new life buoys or whatever they call them that you throw out in the water to save people. They got another scene that makes a reference to Mary Poppins. That has, um, that's oh got a cute little elephant and some monkeys and stuff. So they're still working on that. And Splash, they put off for now. They said it's too much. They haven't. They're not finished yet with the with the how they're going to do it. So they put that off for now. Probably till after the 50th. I don't think they're going to start in the middle of it. We'll see. But for now, it's on hold. It's on hold. And uh, the main street station only has the two ends covered. The rest of it's uncovered, which is good. Good. Get her done. And, um, oh my god. A new, sh a new show? A new shoe? No. <laughs> new snow. I can read it now. New snow has been painted on the top of the Beauty and the Beast castle for Be Our Guest. And now they're working on painting the castle. They're gonna kill me. I didn't spray. I thought I'll be just out here and do it quick. I, I need my thumb. Yeah, I need it. My fingers are orange. I was eating tackies with the kids. <laughs> they're good. I like them. You all like tackies? Yeah. They're, they're yummy. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I put the new new show and put it instead of snow. Well, that's it's supposed to be an N, but it looks like an H to me. All right. So they've added more bright and beautiful paint to where you're walking down to get loaded onto the small world. So it's starting to look amazing. Yes, it looks really good. If I can make it there. If I ever get to Disney again. If I ever have enough blood to keep me going. So yeah, it, lo it looks amazing. It's coming right along. I don't, I don't remember which parks we're going to this time. I know Epcot for sure. I don't, I don't remember the other one. Okay, okay. And the Mad Tea Party's getting a makeover. They're all getting made over for the 50th. Everything's getting made over. Construction, construction, construction. Welcome. And um, and the Mad Tea Cups, too, are getting repainted. They add, they're adding new stuff onto that. It's going to look gorgeous. I can't wait. And um, the Prairie Outpost of Frontierland is now finito, and they've taken down the, the, the walls there, so that's all finished. A little bit at a time. Don't, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Dumbo and Timothy is going to be part of the 550, the Fab 50 Golden at Magic Kingdom. And um, the Liberty Square Riverboat is going to be closing for a few days here coming up in August. Uh, Refurb, they've done that thing so many times in the last few months. I don't know what's going on with that. But, but anyhow, just for a few days. Uh, uh, anything else exciting? Did I miss anything? I said the Fab 50 Dumbo. Ah, he's so cute. Okay, let's talk Boo Bash. The first night was last night. It got mixed reviews. They say it's nothing like Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, which is what... I didn't bring my soda out. That's what's wrong. I need a drink. So, they say it's nothing like, uh, uh, you know, Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. There was no special merch, and a lot of people were upset about that. You pay for a special event, and there's nothing to bring home that was special. Besides a treat bag and a map. <laughs> no special merchandise, no special popcorn buckets, no special mugs, ice cubes, nothing like that. 
not the ice cubes, the little things you put in your drink, the glow. Glow cubes. There we go. No special glow cubes, nothing like that. It, but the wait times for attractions were low. The wait times for attractions for low. They said that's the only reason it'd be worth it, 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 to spend the money. It's not even worth it for uh, you know like two people. It's annual pass holders go in can go in like until October. It's like $159 for three hours. They had the character cavalcades. They had the uh, cadaver dance. Uh, they did have treat spots, but. People said, a lot of people said it was packed, and people said, oh, it's not that bad. Well, th it was supposed to be sold out already, but they were selling tickets, y'all. For Now, they were sold out in a few hours, but they were selling tickets the day of, which you're probably going to do. Probably maybe not uh, October, Halloween night, but they were selling tickets. They're pushing them people in there like sardines. The only thing that was good, because a lot of people just went, uh for, you know, to take your kids trick-or-treat and to see the characters and to see, you know, Jack and Sally and, and, you know, and they had a lot of good photo pass as well. A lot of good photo pass. Um, but it's nothing like a Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party. And they says as far as the free drinks and cookies, you can forget it. The lines were insane. <laughs> insane. So, no, I'm glad we're not paying to go because I'd be upset. It's not worth it. You can buy you a Halloween treat or snack. There's nothing special for that either. It's just there for the party. So, yeah. Let's try next year for Mickey's Not So Scary. Shall we? Okay, okay. Let's move over to Hollywood Studios. Uh, R2-D2 will be one of the Fab 50 Golden. Yes. And um, so will Sebastian. And Flounder will make their uh, debut uh, for the 50th at Hollywood Studios. And... The mixed popcorn come back at Kat Saki's, I don't know how I say it, Sataki's uh, kettle, and before they said it was good. It was, it's like spicy and sweet. It's purple and orange popcorn, uh, and they say it's, yeah, blah. Don't know. Haven't tried it since they've reopened, so we'll have to see. Because I love popcorn, usually. Not if it's gross, though. <laughs> And the ticket booths are under refurb. They should, it shouldn't be down long, but the ticket booths are under refurb. And that's all I have for Hollywood Studios. Epcot we got a little bit. And uh, Animal Kingdom is blank. So yeah, it shouldn't, I shouldn't lose too much more blood. Okay, Food and Wine Fest is still kicking in full swing. And Joffy's Coffee is offering an annual pass holder. It's called a Nitro Dream. It's a cold coffee. And uh, it looks like it'll jack you up. <laughs> I don't know if looks could be deceiving, but it looks like it's got some, yeah, dark, dark, yeah, roast in there. Some espresso. <laughs> I got to try one. It looks, yeah. Oh, my Lord. Why not express? Ah, no, I'm going to be there for a few minutes. Okay. New merch has been added. They're adding new merch to uh, the Apple Orchard Collection and the Beauty and the Beast Collection for the food and wine. And the cast members are getting their preview for Remy's Ratatouille, August 19th. And um, then it's followed by September, which will be DVC, and then annual pass holders. We'll be going the 11th uh, from 6 to 7 for our preview. No cameras, no photography, nothing. They don't want to spoil it for everybody else. So, uh, some new characters have showed up in their uh, perspective uh, lands. Or countries, and that would be Belle, Aurora, and Snow White. So it's distance. They're gonna be, you know, you're gonna be in front of them, but you can do your selfies and stuff like that, or get your friends in there and have somebody snap a pic. Oh my God, that wasn't a good idea. And uh, the interior, exterior lights have finally been added to Mouse Gear, and they're putting in a quick service restaurant there as well. Yeah, it's, it's the cool spot, too. Not the cool ship, the cool spot where you go taste that delicious Beverly. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. And, and Orange Bird. Orange Bird will be sh appearing at Epcot for part of the Fab 50 Golden. Yes, Orange Bird. Oh, I'm excited to hear about that. Animal Kingdom, there ain't nothing going on there. They've actually said Animal Kingdom's been nice and quiet. Except for Flight of Passage. It's always a pff, ridiculous there. 
They say if you go in the morning, it's, you know, 40, 45 minute wait. After that, you're waiting a couple hours. All right, Disney Springs and Resorts. Cruise Cup reopened at the um, Yacht and Beach Club along with the Steakhouse, uh, uh, Yachtsman Steakhouse. And it got good reviews. So, yeah, I haven't been there in forever. And um, the tarps that were contemporary that they took down, they're putting some of them back up. <laughs> I would I would be upset if I paid all that money for that. I, I'd be really, really upset. And um, the wave at the Contemporary, the whole sign, everything's gone. They got walls up, but you can see they ripped the whole sign down and everything. They're saying it's going to be rethemed Incredibles, just like they did Satriro's at the Grand to Mary Poppins. And... Um, it did come out with, Betty Johnson come out with a new Haunted Mansion collection that was spotted at the Contemporary. But it's expensive for costume jewelry. It's expensive. Uh, a little necklace is like a hundred bucks, so I, I'm out on that. And the Polly's slowly being put back together, the monorail station. They got up another one of them. You remember the orange and uh, red triangle things? They're, they're coming back. They got the second one installed. So that's nice. That's nice. And Toledo's is back open at the Coronado. Oh, my God. The Flying Fish at the Boardwalk is set to open in September, along with Jelly Rolls in the Dance Hall. So hopefully all that will be back open before the 50th as well. And the rider switch has changed. How you could go on and swap and then go back on with your party if you had to have a small child or someone that was unable to do the attraction. Too many people are abusing it. They're saying, okay, he, we're not going to let him go on, and then we're all going to go in. Uh, we'll ride it. And then, so you have to wait in line twice. You have to wait in line once. And then you do the switch, and then but the other party doesn't have to wait, and they get to go back on. And usually the whole group would get back on again. They're saying, uh-uh. They're saying, you, if you had to stay with a child or whoever it was you stayed with, you can go back on with one more person, not your entire party, to try to cut that out of the abuse of that, which is nice, which is nice. So they switched it up a little bit, which is good. And, um, oh my God. And not all attractions offer the rider switch. It's just for the attractions that do, because some of them are like Small World. Everybody can do it. <laughs> Everybody. So, no, there's no rider switch. It's Small World. Okay? Just saying. <laughs> so that's good for Disney. That's good that they did that. And um, the Halloween treats and everything's available um, all day. All day at all four parks, they have special Halloween stuff. And they got the Hollywood and Vine uh, Mickey party back, too. It's not really a party, the dinner or the lunch. I think it's dinner. I posted about it on, on www.disneydiva.com on Facebook. Oh my God, I gotta get in there. So, yes, that's back at Hollywood and, and Vine. Hollywood and Dine's what they call it. So, yes, Mickey will be dressed in her Halloween best with a few of her friends. What the hell are they doing back there? Yeah, they tearing down the house. Burning down the house. Okay, so all the resorts are going to offer a couple Halloween treats and goodies, uh, along with all the parks. So you don't think you just have to go to Magic Kingdom and get all the Halloween. No, it's spread out. It's spread out everywhere. So don't worry. No matter what park you're going to, you're going to find Halloween stuff. Yes. But they are limiting the merch to two items per, per per guest. So you can only get two. But a lot of stuff's already sold out regardless. Now whether they're going to bring it back or not because they were trying to keep it on the shelves a little bit longer but that didn't work either. Because they're letting so many people in there. Uh, uh, I think I skipped over some stuff. <sighs> okay, so the Muppets Haunt The Muppets Haunted Mansion special will um, be showing on the Disney Plus and oh my god they did a sneak peek for the release and, and the costumes and stuff they're wearing looks really cute now let's get down to some meat and taters y'all the cast member unions are the cast member unions are now negotiating on uh, whether their union members have to get this see I put that with a little the little the skull and yeah that <laughs> that's my drawing it's about as good as it gets and um, so we'll, I'll let you know when and if that happens when and if if when yeah. 
And uh, the Run Disney Wine and Dine Half Marathon, uh, the villain one, uh, they showed the preview of the medals and the stuff like that that you get for doing it. It, it looks awesome. And now, according to a federal judge that ruled uh, on the matter, Disney Cruise Line can ask you to show proof of that before they let you go on the cruise. We'll see what our wonderful governor does about that. And as far as the rumors that they're spreading about all the stuff going down here and we need ventilators and the hospitals are for full, it's not true. It's not true. Just so you know, it's not true. Okay, let's get to all the rave. And I forgot to write down a did you know. But did you know that they're adding uh, special new windows now? Uh, Jeff Vialde, or the president of Walt Disney World, named three members who's getting their own window now. Because you know that all the windows on Main Street are dedicated to Imagineers, uh, cast members that have worked there. So there, there's three people. Did you know that? Okay, I'm going to throw that in there for did you know. Okay, all the rave. All the rave's the Halloween merch. Okay, and um, the purple purple wall lounge fly that just showed up is flying off the shelf. It, it looks it looks like the purple wall. It's really cool. And um, the Halloween merch, especially the Oogie Boogie Lounge Fly, it's sold out. Even though they had a two limit per guest. And the Oogie Boogie Spirit jerseys, that they're down to like extra small and extra, extra, extra large. Same with the uh, Hocus Pocus. But they did really have some cool photo pass picks that they didn't have before. So that is all the rape. Oh, and the Halloween Bobble Bear earrings. Bobble Bar earrings. I can't read my own writing. So yes, yes, yes. That is all the rave. Them lounge flies and them spirit jerseys, y'all. I, I wish I lived somewhere where I could wear a spirit jersey more than once a year. So we are bracing ourselves for Tropical Storm Fred. He ain't going to be that bad. It's just because uh, we're on the east side of the storm. We're just going to get a lot of rain. I got one thing to show, and I'm going to let you all roll because... I got sh I got to go in there and smoke my printer and get y'all stuff out tonight. So I just got this in the mail today. This is the the uh, coin purse that I got from the the Primark, but this is a limited edition Harvey's. It's not a Disney one. That's what I, I got this, and it looks good on there. I'm gonna move it down probably. But this is a limited edition. They only made 250 of them. I think I got two no, number 239. I don't remember. I just got in the mail today. 223 of 250. And it's an older bag. It's an older one. But this one came with... Um, oh God. It came with the big hang tag. This one. The old style ones. And it is limited in... I don't want to lose it, so I'm keeping it in there. And it came with this mirror. It says seatbeltbags.com, and it's a mirror. Yeah, isn't that cool? All right, y'all. I'll see you on Friday for Yak Attack. I'm going to bring you and get my kissy poo out, and I'm going to go in there and print out some labels and get my button post office. Yeah. Yes, I am. So enjoy the rest of your week. I will see you on Friday. I'll see you back on the page, so don't worry. Uh, comment, like, like my video, subscribe, it's a one of these here kerners, so hit the subscribe button. Uh, in the meantime, God bless you, God bless America, prayers for Cuba. Well, y'all, peace out.